Hello there, I'm Pikachu, and as we know in this world, there are many types of stereotypes. In this video, I'm going to be showing off some of the funniest, stupidest, and maybe coolest stereotypes for the Pokemon world. So, let's get to it. We'll start off with this first stereotype. The Super Athlete. Alright, here's the Vertical Leap Meowth. Let's see if you can do it. Oh, sorry, you're going to have to take a, an average on that one. Dang it. Alright, Lucario, do the Vertical Leap. Whoa! That is a new school record! No way! Congratulations! Ha! That's what I get. Oh yeah, let's get it, boys. Let's do it! Lucario! 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 Now he's a super athlete. Now we'll move on to the popular stereotype, you know. These kids are always the ones who are kind of snobby, try to act super cool and popular, and try to, you know, make everybody feel bad about themselves. Yeah, dude, the new Rocket League game just came out. Yeah, and also, I've been playing a lot of uh, Skyrim lately. Yeah, dude, Skyrim, oh, it's such a fun game. Pfft. Dude, look at those geese. Yeah, I know, they're so gay, dude, yeah. They're, like, just freaking stupid. Yeah, I like talking about stupid little video games. Yeah, they're so stupid and gay. Yeah, freak them. And they were so much cooler than them. Yeah, they're, like, bo the bottom of the bottom, dude. The next stereotype, the rich kid. Now, this kid always brags about how much money he has. How much he spends on a pair of shoes, things like that. Yo, dude, what are those? Oh, uh, I don't really want to put them on right now because I don't want to get them dirty, but these are my LeBron 14s. Well, how did you get those? I pre ordered them for like 3000 bucks. Well, my parents would never let me do that. I don't have nearly enough for that. Yeah, it's because I'm not freaking poor. I can actually afford things. Jeez. Yeah, you know, some guys don't have as much money as other people, but, you know, those rich snobby kids. I <sighs> can't do nothing about them. The next one is the really stupid kid. This kid fails his classes, he does nothing all class, and he's just plain old stupid. And for this answer, what is two squared to the sixth power? Jolbert? Uh... Yeah. <laughs> I don't really see him making it past the grade he's in now. Speaking of, you know, school, type things. We're going to go to the really smart kids. These kids are the ones who ace all their quizzes and they're super smart and a little bit nerdy. Uh, okay, I guess I did all right. I got a B on it. Hey, what'd you get on the quiz? Uh, 100. What? How? Dude, I like, I really, I studied for like eight hours for this stuff. You are a little bit nerdy, just saying. All right, you're done for. You know, guys who study a lot, do really good on their quizzes. Kind of makes sense for those smart kids. Now the next one, the final one for stereotype, this is the first stereotype. There's many, many stereotypes, so this won't really become be a series, but there will be a lot of stereotype videos because I know these are kind of interesting and just funny to point out. This one is going to be the kid who goes to school and thinks his hair looks good when it looks really, really bad. Ah, uh, I'm sure my hair looks good. Yeah, it looks fine. Hey, dude. He's got to fix his hair. What did you say? Oh, nothing. I was just pointing out. Uh, anyway... So how are you been doing? Good, how are you? I'm perfectly fine. Uh, you know, you got a little something there in your hair. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh. Anyways. So yeah, these are just some stereotypes in school, out of school, anything like that. So, if you guys do like these stereotype videos, make sure to leave a like below, comment below what stereotypes you want to see in another stereotype video. This is the first stereotype video. I will be doing a second one, maybe in the next upcoming weeks or sometime soon. Let me know what stereotypes should I do next. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out. And we got our run last stereotype here, and that's the kid who sits in his room after school every day and on the weekends and plays GTA 5 and Rocket League. He plays it on his PS4 all frickin' day. Yeah, I wonder who that loser could be. Like, seriously, honestly. Uh, oh, oh, that's me. Uh, well, that's pretty awkward.